<laughs> Hi everyone, welcome to Moments of Grace. So now in this video today, we're going to be talking about the topic of fear. And fear strikes each and every one of us at one point or another, depending on what's happening. But one thing we need to know is that fear does not come from God. In 2 Timothy 2, 7, it says, For God has not given me the spirit of fear, but of power, love, and of a sound mind. And this is really important, guys. So let's get started. Now, in Philippians 4, 6 through 7, it says, Do not be anxious for anything, but in everything by prayer and uh, supplication with thanksgiving, make your requests made known to God. And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. Isn't this beautiful? And we can read these things out of Scripture, and Scripture pretty much pieces itself. So, um, when anxiety weighs heavy on your heart, take a moment and pause and pray. Um, and present your request to God. Express your gratitude for his presence in your life, even amidst the difficulties. Allow the peace of God to guard your thoughts, your emotions, knowing that he is with you every step of the way. In Hebrews 13, 5, it says, I will never leave you nor forsake you. This is very important, that we not only speak the word of God, but that we choose to believe that what he's saying is true. Amen. So now remember that you are not alone in your struggles, and the Bible is filled with verses that speak to uh, of God's constant care and comfort for all of his children. In Isaiah 41.10, it says this, Fear not, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Isn't that awesome to be in the arms of our Father who loves us so very much? And it is not Him who causes all these things, but every day-to-day -day things that we go through can bring on that evil spirit of fear. And so we can choose to believe it or choose to know that our Father carries us as we go through the day and always. So now, let this verse serve as a reminder that God always by he's always by your side he's ready to strengthen and support you and lean on him and trust that he will provide the strength and the courage that you need to face any anxious situation may all of these verses bring you comfort and guidance and the strength to overcome anxiety take heart for your god's presence and assurance you uh, can find peace even in the midst of turmoil and so like i said he promises never leave us nor forsake us he's with us always he's inside of us and he loves us and so no matter how we're feeling if we keep our eyes focused on god you will find that that fear has to leave it cannot dwell where he dwells because it doesn't come from him he loves you and so with this being said meditate on this during the course of the day and i wish you have a blessed and amazing day filled with god's favor and grace and love in the name of jesus i'll see you for the next moments of grace amen <laughs>